Monica Lewinsky is back in the public sphere. She gave a major TED speech earlier this week. Monica Lewinsky getting a lot of attention for a well-received TED speech. She spoke at a TED conference for roughly 18 years max time that TED gives you, and she spoke about the whole industry of public shaming and cyberbullying, something presumably she knows a lot about. Now, you may have very strong opinions about Monica Lewinsky. I'll be honest with you, I don't really have strong opinions about Monica Lewinsky in favor or against. But I do think it was smart of her to use this venue. There is something different about giving a speech versus simply being interviewed. If she had just given a, another interview to Barbara Walters or the Today Show, there's always the chance that that sound bite where she says something like, well, sure, I still think of Bill Clinton, that that becomes the total headline. And that's all anyone talks about. When you give a speech, you can make a sustained argument for something serious and you don't have to take questions. So the news coverage is featuring and focusing on a lot of her messages about cyberbullying, how bad it is, public shaming, the whole public shaming industry, and she's being quoted from her speech. So that gives her more control. That's why politicians so often like to have major speeches. It allows you to set the agenda, and that's why I think it was smart of her to do so. because. Even though an 18-minute speech is short by the standards of most speeches, that's a long time compared to an eight-second soundbite or even a three, three-and-a-half-minute interview on the Today Show. So it's a long time to make a sustained argument about something you care about. Now, Monica Lewinsky has been gone from the public sphere for a long time. It's been about a decade, according to most reports. Here she is back. And she has gotten tremendous reviews for this speech, standing ovations. It's getting a lot of popular press. Where will she go with this? I don't know yet. If she follows up with lots and lots of interviews on this subject of cyberbullying, and she comes out with books and goes on a paid speaking series on this, maybe she can actually be a, a substantive public person. I don't know yet, but I do know this. At least she is trying to contribute something in the public sphere, ideas, something in public discourse, and getting out there and trying to focus on ideas is a lot better than just being the butt of jokes.